Hello fellow YouTubers. Today I'm going to do a lesson on Perfidia. This is a song that uh, I just ended up learning and uh, I thought I would do a quick video while it's still fresh in my mind. Um, it's a pretty pretty easy song although there are a few difficult parts in it uh, um, that can be challenging but uh, uh, otherwise it's not too bad. So I'll just jump right into it. So it's in the key of C um, and it starts off um, you know just doing a uh, bar chords so you know you probably have to be somewhat advanced to do this it's just a and then there's a little guitar part that walks in comes in on the intro So, uh, again, you're thinking of the key of C, so most of this is just a... revolving right around the C chord. So, um, I would encourage you to, to go through this, and, and uh, I'll show you the chords as I go, as I go through it, but uh, go through and get the chords, you know, uh, down first, and then it's kind of it's a lot easier to, to do the little lead parts. Now, there are some, some good tabs on this song here, and I have to admit, I you know, normally I don't use tabs, but I, this the little part where the little lead part or chorus part where it goes to the F, I had to look at the, the tabs, and the, Tom Conlon, the, the guy who makes these backing tracks, he has some really good tabs, and I thought, well, maybe I'll do, do a video just because I know some people don't like to use tabs or... Um, have a problem with them. I, I much don't. Uh, I don't use them all that much. Uh, but sometimes they do come in handy. So um, just kind of keep that in mind. Um, <clears throat> so uh, okay. So right off the bat, you're you're just right here on a C chord, on a C major scale. show you that little part there um, that part there is kind of tricky because it's going to go to E then to a G Let me do the second verse now. Then, this is where it gets a little bit complicated, so... Um, second part of it, you're going to hold down this F then and then uh, it's just walking down the G this the scale from the G Okay, so let me do the whole thing uh, from the from the very from the, the the first verse. Okay.
Okay, so that's the the first section of the song. Then it's going to um, go through the chords again. And then it changes keys. It goes to the key of D. So now you're thinking of... Um, of a D major scale here and, and a D chord. Okay, your, your D chord. So now, if you just visualize this scale here, it's basically the same thing as it was in, in C. Tune. Um, then, um, so on this part, it's going to go to the G. Da, 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 da. So a good way to look at this is you just have these open two strings, which is part of a G chord, and then this is just part of your G chord. Up, so. And I'm just hitting this high E. You could go here. But I find it's a little bit easier to hit the high E so you have time to grab this F sharp, okay? That's, that's kind of a, this is like the tricky part of the song. Then, down here from this uh, this A. Okay, so let me do that, that section for you. Um, Okay, so that'll get you all the way through the whole song. It's a, uh, um, it just takes a little bit of practice on those those little, uh, the little bridge parts with all these. Little... Folks, well, thank you so much for watching. I hope that that will will help you out a little bit. And and as I said earlier, um, uh, Tom Conlon has some uh, some tabs on this. That's how I learned it. And uh, like I said, I just thought I would do a quick video um, uh, on this. You know, since I just learned it. And uh, have fun with this song. It's great to play. But like I said, it just takes a little bit of work on that uh, the, the the middle parts. But uh, just practice enough, and you'll get it. Thanks a lot for watching. I really appreciate it, and hopefully we will see you on the next video. Okay, bye-bye.